Hi everyone, I'm Yong Long and for today's Tableau tip, I'm about to present on dumbbell charts. Dumbbell charts are a great way to illustrate change or compare between data points. It is one of my favorite charts as it is pretty easy to create on Tableau but yet an effective visualizing tool. So it is really flexible as well and it can be used in a wide variety of use cases. Right here, I have a comparison of the sales performance of the subcategories across the various regions you can see right here on the color legend but instead if i want to compare the year on year between the various subcategories i can simply change it uh, just drag order date to the regions and an order date to sub the region up in the line chart and right here i have the comparison between subcategories based on year on year so to create dumbbell charts, you need to have a basic understanding of dual axis charts first. So it's made by combining two elements. First is the line chart, combining the various points. And next, of course, are the various dots you can see right here. So are the various dimensions. So today, we would like to compare the sales of regions within the different subcategories. But we have to identify the three main factors first. The dimension we want to compare, which is in this case region. The measure value we are comparing, which is sales right here. And of course, the context of the, the scope of the comparison, which is subcategories right here. So I will drag the scope and measure value into the columns and rows first. So I will drag the subcategory and the sales into the columns and rows first. And I just have to convert them into the circle charts to create these circles. So if I want to illustrate the various regions, the points of the various regions, I can put them over in color. And here I have the four region points right in the graph. So for the line charts, I have to create a another chart so it's simply just uh, duplicate the columns the sum of sales at the columns and for the second column at the at the right which you created uh, simply you just have to change the circles to a line chart but however Tableau has sense that you want to connect the lines based on the various subcategories so in order to change this you have to uh, edit some changes to the marks cut for the line graph so by default regions will be placed at color but all you have to do is drag region right here to the path so by then Tableau will sense that you want to connect the various regions so let me just flip the chart to a horizontal chart and you will have the line connecting the various regions so all you have to do now is to just create a dual axis by simply hovering, right clicking on sales right here. Right click on it, click on dual axis and you have a, a dumbbell chart right here. So, but before that, we have to make some edits. So if you zoom in closer to the various circles, you'll see that the line is in fact blocking the dumbbell, the, the circ these points in the dumbbell chart. So to make sure you fix this, simply just uh, drag this column, which is the line, to the front. So right here, as you zoom in, you can see that the line won't be blocking the circles in the dumbbell chart. So if you want it to be more flexible, you can change the, you can add on the region to filters as well. So in order to make it more interactive for the end user, you can show filter. For the region and you can check out or check in boxes you want to include or exclude to the visualization so that's it for my tableau tip so see you in the next video thank you